times have changed. With farmers storing their grain for longer periods of time, ensuring that the grain is properly dried down is essential to maximizing quality, efficiency, and market value. Drying your grain on farm provides you with the flexibility to protect yields, harvest when conditions are optimal, and preserve grain quality for long-term storage. Rather than waiting for crops to dry down in the field, farmers are benefiting from harvesting earlier and drying their grain. The weather's always different, your conditions are different every year, so this gives you flexibility of harvesting early. Um, also, when you dry it down, you know exactly how that corn is going into the bin, and if it goes and dry, it's going to um, stay in condition longer in the bin. You don't have to worry about it crusting in the bin. I think, you know, having the dryer um, is a huge efficiency on the farm. Now, you can only dry so much in a day, but, you know, you can start earlier. In my opinion, it's a little bit better. We, we cut down on, on drying costs, hauling to the elevator, and also shrinkage. Because I got to get in the field and get the crop out, get it in the bin. Once I get it out of the field, I feel like I'm closer to where I need to be. But I can't just leave it there and let it dry in the field. It's not going to happen. You don't have the invisible losses from the sea. You don't have the blowdown problems from the weather, and you don't have the, the head losses when, once you get below 20%. So it's a very important thing that you have a dryer in order to make that possible. Making sure that the grain is stored properly, especially in today's large capacity bins, is critical. I would say the number one reason we dry our grain is to keep it in condition in the bins. Um, there's been a few times when the corn just did not dry down and we lost that on the market value. Proper storage in a larger bin is more difficult than trying to store in a small bin. You got to make sure that grain is already down to 15% to be able to safely store it. Since we're storing the grain for a longer period of time, it becomes even more critical. If you're going to store it till next fall, you really need to be 15 at the highest possible point. Drying and storing grain provides more flexibility for those farmers who want to market their grain at the best possible price. I get to play a little bit more and market my grain better because of the dryer situation. I can sell it in September because I can make it happen. You know, I can dry it and make it happen. And then I'm comfortable once it comes out of the dryer, storing it, holding it, and I'm still delivering a quality product. I can go out six months down the road to get a premium on my grain or at harvest when there's a premium. I can still dry it and make it happen. I really think a dryer ends up paying for itself over time. You know, as long as you use it correctly and you store and try to capture, you know, the market. You know, storage and drying, I think in the end, pays for itself. It's really made life easier on the farm and you can sleep better at night.